Here's a video of two different sorts of pendulums. On the left we have a double pendulum, which I think is what most amateurs have in their mindset as to the way the golf swing works. You can see it hinges and unhinges around the wrist joint. But the face never closes, it stays open all the time and requires mus muscle effort to shut the face. But now look at the conical pendulum on the right. It rotates around the arm and the face closes as it gets into the impact area. Now let's look at Steve Stricker who um, is the best example of what I'm trying to talk about. If you look at this angle between his arm and the club, it doesn't change all the way through his swing. There's there's no hinging and unhinging of the wrist. That is, there is no wrist set. But you look at it at the impact area, it, that angle is still there. And the face is closing, so it must be acting as a conical pendulum, not as a double pendulum. Now it's very difficult to, to get your mind around this and to actually swing a club with that in mind. The physics tells me that this is the way all pros swing a golf club. And Steve Stricker just happens to be the, the best example of it. 